the state attacked expert witnesses in front of the jury with non-evidence designed to mislead. Witness intimidation began almost the, same, the very day that Ms. Arias started a case, or at least those days when Ms. Arias wasn't on the stand. The issue here is why Ms. Womack is not here to testify. On two separate occasions, she failed to answer my questions. Specifically, the first occasion occurred when I started to talk about her drug use as it involved the witness and the defendant. At that point, she deferred and chose not to answer. When this court allows a prosecutor to personally attack witnesses and counsel, that breeds an environment where this sort of thing is endorsed. This court can only speculate as to why Ms. Womack is not here today. Ms. Womack and I would move to withdraw from the case yet again. Your motion to withdraw is denied. We will not be calling witnesses in the face given the court's ruling. Judge, the other thing we'd be asking for consistent with this court's ruling on both aspects of the motion for mistrial, the sentencing phase, we'd be asking a stay of these proceedings so we could seek special action relief. Your motion for stay is denied. We are unable to proceed today. Please return tomorrow morning at 9.30. Please remember the admonition. You are excused.